Welcome to Columbia's testing facility. This is probably one of the most advanced facilities available to any outdoor brand in the industry. And today we're validating and quantifying the performance of our OmniHeat insulation. And we're monitoring the performance both on a human tester and then we're also testing it on Newton, our thermal mannequin, who has the 26 heat zones that we can monitor. With Drew, what we're able to do is monitor with a thermal imaging camera his heat loss and obviously track his comfort over time during physical exertion with the Omni Heat product on. The lining has a reflective pattern that bounces the heat back at the body, but it's also partial. So the remaining area that's not shiny is actually a moisture wicking, air permeable base lining material that can continue to pass moisture and excess heat out of the garment. And then just behind that is our new Omni Heat insulation. So Drew's just finished testing the, the first Omni Heat prototype and uh, the results were excellent. He worked himself up to where his body was sweating just because of high rope goat put and then went to standing still like you would at a ski hill and was able to have a dry feeling very quickly. And then we left him at a pretty high activity level but not full aerobic for quite a long period and we took his jacket off, absolutely no sweating inside and the lining material is perfectly dry. So. He said he felt very comfortable the whole time. So in the first part of this experiment, we ran a typical insulated jacket. And the green line represents uh, the thermal resistance of the product, and the blue line represents how hard Newton is working. So then we switched into the same kind of jacket, uh, but with omni-heat insulations. And all of a sudden, Newton doesn't have to work near as hard. He drops from working at 280 down to 220, so he's uh, able to conserve energy. But that's because the insulative value of the product jumped from being around 0.165 to being about 0.185 to 0.18, which is about a 20% increase in insulative value. I think that the Omni Heat jacket seems to be more of a stable temperature jacket. It doesn't quite drop so quickly. I think it keeps you warm while you're cooling off so you don't go below the point where you get really cold. And you just cool off to your normal body temperature. So yeah, I think the Omni Heat works great.